Terrell, lovely to meet you. Um, absolutely loves this movie. It is absolutely wonderful. Where did the idea come from for you? Uh, a lot of it is based on an autobiographical story from my life. Uh, I grew up in Liberty City, a place in Miami that uh, is, uh, some people don't know about. You think about Miami, think about bikinis and, uh, and rum. But um, there is something quite uh, interesting about shaving something. Or sharing something that's really from the heart. So that's where the story's impulse comes from. Was it one of took it and went and ran? Yeah. yeah. I was just gonna ask you, was it one of those stories that it took you a while to kind of get get it made, if you like? Was it something that once Barry came on board, yeah, it was just something that you well, just went off? It was. It's, it's an interesting story, and uh, I mean, if, when we sit down and talk about it, you'll, you'll, you'll hear it happen. But it's something that I wasn't really sharing with everyone. I shared it with a, a few key people, and it ended up in Barry's hands. And then all of a sudden, he became uh, became extraordinarily excited about it. And once he got excited about it, things just start to happen. When it goes from page to screen, I mean, you must write these things and have an idea of what it looks like. But when you see the finished form, it's absolutely beautiful. Can you have imagined it would be just so good? Never. <laughs> Never imagined. That's that's Barry, that's James Laxton, that's Adela. They worked really hard to preserve the kind of poetry in the in the dialogue on the page. You know, mostly I'm a playwright. And so, you know, they heard that dialogue and they really wanted to create it and make it uh, something visual. And that was something, it's something stunning. I never could have imagined. So got a wonderful cast, obviously the two guys, either side of you, and then the young guys as well. <laughs> just, <laughs> just fantastic cast. I mean, when you saw that what they were doing, it must have must have made you so proud. Uh, absolutely, and especially with Alex Hubbard, who Alex Hibbert, pardon, who is from Liberty City too, is from Miami, is homegrown. It's good to see and to know that there are people who are that young who are able to stand with that kind of majesty next to people like Andre Holland, and next to Mahershala Ali, and next to Janelle Monae, um, and and tell that intimate story. And they they've become a bit of a family. I know they get tired of me sort of running up to them and hugging them, but. Um, they're portraying people that I knew and loved, and, and so now they become people I know and love. I would just asked Trevante about obviously the award season and everything that could come. Are you ready for kind of that onslaught? Were you, were you prepared at the beginning to you think, wow, we're going to be at the Oscars or something like that? I'm prepared for people to see this story. That's what I really I'm excited about. I really want to see uh, how people react to uh, and engage with this story. And, and so far, it's been so good. So. That's all I can hope for. Yeah. I loved it, and uh, I really want to see it again. It was absolutely amazing. Thank you so much for your time. Pleasure to meet you. Thank you. This guy's in here again. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys. Hey You Guys, huh? Hey you guys, Is that yeah. from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice. Hey! hey.